All right, welcome to Professional Scrum with Jira. I am Professional Scrum Trainer Ryan Ripley. This gentleman next to me is Professional Scrum Trainer Todd Miller. How are you, Todd? Great. How are you? Hello, doing doing great. Excited to talk about Professional Scrum with Jira. Uh, of course, we are Professional Scrum Trainers with Scrum.org, the home of Scrum. We do want to point you real quick to Atlassian University, right? training.atlassian.com. If you'd like to learn more about how to use Jira software after this, head over to Atlassian University, training.atlassian.com. There you'll find tons of self-paced training resources to help you become an expert at Jira software. All right, Todd, today we are taking a look at sprint planning. We are. And so sprint planning, one of our Scrum events. We're going to talk about sprint planning in the context of professional Scrum. We take the product backlog. We take the past performance and capacity of the Scrum team. We take the definition of done. We take the current state of the product increment. We take our retrospective improvement items, and we evaluate all those things together as we try to figure out, first of all, why are we running the sprint, right? We're going to define or refine a sprint goal. That is the why of the sprint. That is the objective we're trying to achieve. It is the impact we're trying to have on the world or for our customers. Then we're gonna think about the what. We're gonna analyze, evaluate, and select product backlog items that can help us achieve that sprint goal. And then we're gonna figure out the how. We're gonna decompose enough work into an actionable plan that will allow us to uh, hopefully achieve our sprint goal. So the outcome of this event from a professional scrum setting is a sprint backlog, which is composed of a sprint goal, the selected product backlog items, and an initial plan to help us get started. And so here's what we're going to do. Todd's going to take over and he's going to show us how this works, how professional scrum plays out in Jira. Yeah, thanks Ryan. So, you know, you were mentioning those three 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 topics of discussion during sprint planning. Why, what and how? And we can cover all of those with Jira. And one thing I wanna point out is those things don't happen in order. They can really kind of happen in any order you want. It's just three topics of conversations that we're gonna have during, during sprint planning. And so let's suppose, you know, product owner, scrum master and developers are all together. We're, we're about to discuss sprint planning and we're walking in, the product owner shows up with this ordered product backlog. And as developers, we get together and we say, you know what? Uh, the product owner tells us why behind this, uh, this, uh, this, this PBI here, product backlog item. Uh, we have some description underneath it. We, we've, you know, maybe during product backlog refinement, added some, uh, some of the house, some tasks on what we might do. And we say, developers agree, let's bring this one in. Uh, we like to encourage the developers be the ones that actually bring it into the sprint, right? They are the people that own the sprint backlog. So we like to encourage that. And, you know, we have one PBI in here, Ryan, and uh, I'm not sure exactly, uh, you know, the, the why yet. Doesn't make sense for us to really have had defined a sprint goal. And that's okay at this point by now. And so, you know, the scrum team continues to have a conversation and they, they add this, this PBI and they say, perfect. Yeah, we know we can do this uh, product owner. We can do this developer one. They might add some tasks to this. They might have add some additional tasks on, on describe how with the product owner. And they start to say, you know what? We think we could do all three of these, right? Based off of our past performance, some of which information we can get in Jira, we think we could do all three of these. And I'm starting to see a sprint goal here. Are you, Ryan? Yeah, I'm seeing one emerge here. And I like the way that you're using the issue uh, to really bring that forward. Yeah, thanks. And that's what I think we'll do. Now, uh, the Scrum team says the sprint goal. I think we have a sprint goal, right? So our product backlog here is about training, right? We're going to do some professional Scrum training. And our sprint goal, because we have these three, it seemed really like, you know what we could do? Uh, we want attendees of our training to be able to understand the Scrum accountabilities. That sounds like a good sprint goal, right? We can add that right in here. Sprint goal. Attendees of training uh, understand the accountabilities. You know what else might be worthwhile doing here, Ryan? While we're what, in here and we add this sprinkle. What's that? How do you feel about putting the uh, what we came up with from our retrospective as far as our improvement and adding that into the sprinkle? Really important. Yeah. And, and so let's suppose that our improvement uh, which we've come up with our continuous improvement item that we determined in the sprint retrospective comes in here and we say, you know what, let's add it to our sprint backlog. Um, we don't have to, that's, you know, not a requirement in scrum, but I like to see it, don't you, Ryan? And let's say our improvement was to pair on every product backlog item, PBI for short. I like it. 
you know, as we talk for as a team, uh, we have a, a, a clear sprint goal. We have a plan, right? Uh, it seems like we're ready to start this sprint. We actually have a plan just for the first couple of days, but it seems like we might be ready to start this sprint. What do you think, Ryan? Yeah, I think this is a really nice way to show how we can start our sprint, uh, perform professional scrum, and use Jira as the engine to get us there. Yeah. And also, I'm going to do is hit start sprint, and away we go. I like it. And I think this looks like the beginnings of a very successful sprint, Todd. Love it. Yeah. All right. So, again, we're going to look at professional scrum, see how we made uh, the sprint uh, come to life in Jira. We followed the professional scrum path. And I think that's all we're going to cover in today's video. And so we really hope that you you take these lessons to heart. The product backlog, the scrum team, the definition of done, the increment, the retro improvements, they all come together in this why, what, and how discussion. We're going to end up building the sprint backlog as Todd demonstrated. And you know what? It's going to set us up for the best possible chance of success in the upcoming sprint. All right. We hope you enjoyed this video. We'd really like to encourage you to head over to Atlassian University if you'd like to learn more, training.atlassian.com. Uh, and that'll be this edition of Professional Scrum with Jira. I'm Professional Scrum Trainer Ryan Ripley. This is Professional Scrum Trainer Todd Miller. Hope you have a great time learning about Professional Scrum and Jira. And until next time, scrum on.